Oh, creeper. Ooh. Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Andrew, or Gaming Genesis, and uh, I have a shovel in my hand, because I just knocked down them dirt blocks there. Mm -hmm. But uh, I just want to show you guys what I've been doing. Uh, I haven't posted Minecraft since Friday or Saturday. And I haven't really had any time to play Minecraft, but I did play a little bit today, so I expanded the farm. I needed more wheat, because I need to breed more of these animals. I need mostly just the cows, but I ended up fixing the hole, and I didn't split them apart, because that would have been just a pain in the butt. They're very loud, and I came over here. And I chopped down a whole bunch of trees and I made a little bit of a tree farm right there so that there's just a line of trees there so I could just chop them down whenever I need a whole bunch of trees without making it look ugly around my house but I ended last episode I made a nether portal and we're gonna do that today oh I also added some carpet here and I moved my bed there which I haven't slept in it yet since I moved it so I should probably sleep in it or else bad things happen but there's my chest full of stuff and a lot of people were asking me what's in the secret room and I kept on telling them it's not that big of a deal but it was just cool and kind of kind of a cool thing just to hide it from you guys which I'll show you what is in there at the end of the episode I think I just turned that picture frame yeah I did There we go. But uh, I made this pathway a little bit nicer looking. Also because it was a little bit ugly. It was all smooth stone and cobblestone. And who wants that? But let's just turn down that volume real quick. Because it is pretty loud. Maybe I'll just turn down my system volume. There we go. And did I leave? Yeah, I left some food in there. I think we're all set. And I did currently, I, I did already go in there. Just so it didn't take so long to load it. When I went in there the first time on recording. But you come out here, and this is the nether. For those of you who have never seen the nether, this is it right here. Lava and craziness and these gas just trying to blow me up and I killed him I killed him and I got an achievement because I am awesome but right here this is quartz um, I'll show you guys a little bit what that looks like in building form but uh, I usually don't use quartz too much I just use it to level up as you can see I'm almost level 29 now but right now I kind of want to just explore through here I want to try and find a temple in here so that I know where it is so that when I need a wither skull for a boss battle yeah boss battle um, then I can do that if you guys aren't familiar there is a boss called the wither and he is currently the toughest boss in the game and you have to make him and we'll eventually get to that point but right now we are just gonna get some levels and they kinda correspond levels kinda correspond with the secret room and uh, these are zombie pigmen if I touch one of them they all start attacking me they're pretty strong especially on hard difficulty so I'm gonna try not to hit them and if I do then I'm gonna run but we are level 30, I'm going to stop there with the levels, and I'm just going to run. I'm going to see if I can find a temple. Because also in the temple there's chests and stuff that I can loot. So I can get some good stuff that I can't currently get anywhere else. So that's always good. But... 
we're just gonna go this way. See if see if there's anything down here. Probably not. I never usually have any luck with <laughs> with the Nether, and nor do I really go in there too much. It's just sometimes you really need to go in here, especially if I'm gonna do some uh, brewing. Uh, the Nether is pretty much the only place that you can get the stuff for brewing because you need a blaze rod and I don't have any of that so uh, and there's some lava that's one other thing about the nether there's lava everywhere and it gets really annoying because you're just trying to do productive things and the lava is there and it's just a pain in the butt so I'm just gonna try make sure that I don't get lost that's the big thing especially with me in the nether I get lost all the time because I don't have any system of getting back a lot of people like place torches and stuff but you know I I just don't care enough so I'm gonna go down here apparently I missed my mark a little bit we're almost there Bam, bam. Alright. So this one I will mark with a torch. Just for future reference. And here we go. Another cool thing about coming into the nether is you get glowstone. Glowstone works sort of like a torch, but it's in a block form and it looks better for like houses and lighting effects in a house and stuff like that which I'll show you guys in a little bit I don't, I don't think I'm gonna find a temple anytime soon I wish I would this is soul stand soul stand uh, the only use for it is there are these things in here called nether warts and they grow on them and that's used for brewing so I can make potions of strength and all that good stuff that's gonna help me survive especially in boss battles and let's go get some of this glowstone just gotta hope that I don't miss my swing and hit that pigman <laughs> probably just use my hand and not use any of my tools that's just a waste of durability You can't really move fast on Soul Stand. See, they have like caves and stuff here that are kind of like the ones that you find on the surface, but obviously they don't have like diamonds in them or anything and I can't really get rid of lava because you know water doesn't work in the nether sucks to be me just gonna climb up here oh my god <laughs> oh my god That was a bad idea. Uh, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, man. I don't see any temples anywhere. That sucks.
Running, running, running. Alright guys, I'm back. Um, I cut out like all of the nether scene because it was, it was kind of boring. But uh, now I'm back at my house and I'm ready to show you guys what is in there. Ready? Three, two, one. See how the door opens? That's cool. Uh, eventually this is all going to be covered in bookshelves. But for now, I'm just going to have that. And what what am I going to... See what I'm going to do is I'm going to play this smart. And I am going to enchant everything with like a level 1. Just for now. If I enchant things, they become stronger in certain ways, like efficiency, uh, it cuts down the amount of time. I'm breaking one's good, so it doesn't break as often. Uh, efficiency is really good for, uh, whatchamacallit, efficiency is good because it doesn't use as many swings to break blocks, like a dirt block or something. It won't use as many, but I just thought that was pretty cool. I had that, and obviously I put the painting there because there's a piston right there. So the painting is just covering that up. Yeah. And yeah, but little secrets behind the scenes there because you guys all want to know what I am doing. Gonna kill that guy. Uh, I think I'm just gonna gather some more reeds. Probably gonna call it an early episode. Uh, I'm a little tired. It is almost one o'clock in the morning. And yeah, so I will see you guys in the next video. Probably with more of these guys. And next video, I'm probably gonna plan on going on an adventure. See if I can find a horse. So look forward to that. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.